released February 9, 2022 by developer Lost Rabbit Digital for Linux, Mac and PC. What we've got here on today's experiment is Tumblefire. I'll be playing the PC version. Now, it's in early access, so should we stumble upon some junk? Don't be too hard on it. It's work in progress. Thanks to the devs for the Steam key. In Tumblefire, the point is to plan a heist using common sense and just about anything you can get your hands on across five towns in the Wild West. With fully burnable and interactive environments and a choice system, you set out to destroy and steal whatever you have to in order to get your task done while not getting caught. So let's go light some fires and steal what we must in this potentially hilarious episode of the experiment. Okay, let's go commit some arson. <laughs> oh gosh. Start. Thank you. I like when games give me a reason to commit crimes. I love it. I love it. I can't do it in real life. Do it online. Thank you very much. All right, so this is the environment of the game. And pretty much the premise is you're a drifting pyromaniac that picks up shady work from shady characters to make ends meet. So it kind of fell upon hard times and got to do something to make that money, you know? No problem in that. This is your place. You, you, you live here and you commit crimes to make some money. Yeah. So before long, you find yourself entangled in a tale of greed, revenge and vengeance. Yeah, you, you into that life now. So this is my place, this is my place. And right now we're in the campaign mode. There are two modes to this, but I'll tell you about the other one later on. So, let me get on to this. Okay. Where are we to? Okay, there was, yes, go right here. So you're going to start out small. You start out small with some petty neighborhood squabbles. You burn down an outhouse or two. Nothing serious, right? Nothing serious at all. Small crimes. One second. So this is the guy we do. We come here when we want to get our mission. So I'm going to click this and see what he says. Looks like you're a lucky day, partner. I've got a contract for you. You win? Yeah, I need some money. Of course I'm in. I press enter. No, that's jumping. Press B to accept and enter decline. B to accept, trying to make some money. One of the coffins, go to the undertaker and burn the coffin. I love burning things. You have to burn a coffin? Okay, let's, let's go. I'm so sorry. <laughs> let's find the undertaker. Yeah, so as I said, you're going to start small. A little small fry stuff, and then you go to the big crime, the, 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 what I'm call it, white collar crime. You start burning down big stuff, like, like gambling dens and, and the mayor's deed, and you, you go wild, you, you, you go all the way wild. So, let, let's just find the underworld. It's a building in one of these places, so let's just go and run to find that. This is Grand Hotel. Ammunition, no. So we'll just keep walking. It's a pity that we can't sprint. I would love to sprint in this game. Is that it? No, that's not it. Yes, is it? Hold on, let's keep walking a little bit further. It's right on this stretch. We're going to go inside and burn on a house. That's because we can. But let me just burn down this coffin first. That sounds so messed up. <laughs> Okay, so where is this coffin? The coffin is a morgue, is a dead house, is a okay. That's I don't think this is what we need. Let's 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 go upstairs. It has an upstairs. This look this look weird. So let's let's come here. This is the coffin. I think it it just looked too much out there, and it looked too. Out of place. So let's let's. I think this is what we're supposed to burn down. I don't want to burn down the house yet. Drop it there. So you have your little tools that you have. So you have your number one is your candle. Uh oh, back up, back, back up, back it up, back it up. Uh, 
It's burning. It's burning. It's let, let, it, let it burn. Let it burn. Great work, great partner. Get on to the next time so we can stack up. So we did that. That was the coffin supposed to burn down. So let's find the train station and get the heck out of here before police come. <laughs> uh, all right, where is the train station? It's over there? All right. Let's keep walking. Enjoy this little stroll. So, warning. Do not burn your loot. I will go into one of these shops and show you what you can steal. That is your loot. Do not burn it, because let me tell you something. If you burn down your house without stealing things first, you're going to end up, they don't come back when the, when the house comes back. You're going to walk into an empty place with no loot. So be sure to commit theft before arson. Theft first, arson second. Levels to this. All right, now we can. The next mini task of mine is getting on the, 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 the train. Let's, let's do that. All right. So if you are wondering about your tools, yes, you can upgrade them by, of course, stealing valuables and completing the mission. So we just did a mini mission. A mission. So let's get out of here. Jump, jump, jump. Hey, hey, all right, all right. This is my mini task, you know. Oh, God. I'm lying on my body. Hold on, hold on. Y'all not going to do me like that. Y'all not going to do me like that. Size it up. Don't play with me. Don't, don't play with me. Aha! Yes! So, they said to get in the train, but it's, it's really on top of the train. So, I, I, you're still in the train. And then, I guess you click it. Outstanding work. You'll find five bills on the train. We did that. We did that. So that's mission number one. So there are many tools involved, like torches, planks, and molotovs, the thing you throw to make bombs. And that pretty much is campaign mode. I'm going to show you the things you're supposed to steal before you burn down the house. So let me just show you that real quick. Is this one of them? This look empty though. They ain't got nothing, you know what? Oh, oh, see it, see it, that's how you look first. Do this. And then you just steal it, pressing E. That, can I steal this too? You can't steal these, these are oranges. I can't, I can't steal the oranges? Damn, all right. And then you let it burn. Where is number one? Ta-da! And then we... You can burn this too, you know, see this. Well, I have multiple things, you know, you have a multiple arson devices and before long the place start burning down burn it down to the ground like Paul Bogle did <laughs> all right so as I said there are two modes right so this is the campaign mode and then you have the sandbox mode the sandbox it takes a little bit of pressure off you don't have to worry about missions and whatnot and you can play various scenes with the tools you unlock and they also have unlimited resources so feel free to just walk about and steal stuff and burn stuff down. That is the game. You know, the entire time playing this, I had to fight the urge to shout out, yeehaw. <laughs> On a serious note though, this was interesting, as all experiments seem to be. I had a decent time. I'm not going to say I totally get it and I'm now some tumble fire guru, but I had a good time. Thanks again to the developer for the Steam key. If you like what you saw here, then there is a Steam link in the description. Check it out for yourself. Until next time, I'm Empress Nile, and you've been watching The Experiment here on the Lab Video Game TV, where our game is never over.